Now, I stole from a competition workout, I'm going to be honest with you, um, which is why I, if I chose to do it, I wouldn't have put the two blocks of squat. So the way we're going to do it, is there anyone that isn't, that can't run, that isn't running? All right. Why are you not running? Because you can't run or you just can't be bothered to? I've got the space. Okay. So, no, carry on. No carry. way to run. No way to run. Can't just run out of your street and back again. I'm up two floors. Yeah, I thought you might be me. That's why. Because I, mean, I, I knew that you were in a flat. I could sense it. Andrew, you're outside in a park. What is your excuse for not running? I am. Um, I don't really want to leave my phone in the car park. Fair enough. All right. I could okay. take it with me though. You could take it with you. It's up to you guys. So that's absolutely fine if you don't want to run. What I did with my class this week is just got people to run for twenty five seconds and then run back in again. Yeah. So you just work it out that way. So if you do want to run, either you've planned yourself a little two hundred meter route or you just run out for 200 meters, we'll do it in a second, run back in. Those of you that are not running, you've got a couple of options, okay? 45 seconds, sorry, 50 seconds, yeah, because when we're running, it takes us a bit of time. 50 seconds of double unders, single unders, or penguin jumps, or if you want to make it super tough, you can have 50 seconds of jumps over the dumbbell, yeah, okay? So you're having to keep going. So you're going to either use my timer or set your own timer is probably the best thing to do. Each time between the exercise, you've got 50 seconds, okay? So that's about a 200 metres. 50 seconds every time. Obviously, if you're running, you can do as around go on, you might get a little bit slower, yeah, as you go. So, 20 of everything. It's not too much of an overload. You've got goblet squats. Yeah, we should all know those by now, nice and deep. 20 of those, then off for your 200 run, okay? Then you've got 20 push press, 10 on each arm. Yeah, 10 on each arm, then you'll run. 20 reverse lunges, so opposite in that goblet position, then off for your run. I changed the snatch to the hang clean, just because yesterday you all did quite a lot of uh, snatch, so. You're going to come 10 on each arm for your hang clean, your run, and then the last one, prisoner squats. So weight behind your head into that deep squat. There's no... I'm trying to remember if there's a run after the prisoner squat. This, ooh, sorry. Dan didn't write it down when I sent it to him as a run, but I want to double check. There is a run after the prisoner squats, okay? So, has anyone not written it down? Do you need me to put it in the group? You're all written it down, you're all looking at it. Nadine, I can see you studying it. So, 20 goblet squats and then you run, 20 push press and you run, 20 reverse lunges and you run, 20 hand power cleans and you run, 20 prisoner squats. So, the reason I set a 35 minute time cap, when I did it the other day, I did four rounds in 35 minutes, okay? So I'm expecting, I think my run was a bit shorter. I did it from home. So I'm expecting you guys to get to three rounds at least, okay? Yeah, I want you to push through. It's harder than you think, okay? Especially if you haven't run for a little while. Those of you that are doing the double unders or the single unders or the jumps in between, actually 50 seconds is quite a long time when you're having to do it between every single exercise, yeah? With the run, try and push it. It isn't a rest, okay? Try and keep that pace up on the run. What I want you guys to do, just to warm up, because it's a long workout today, I want to get into it. It's quite old school. Um, I want you to either go for your run or I want you to do a minute of your chosen exercise, okay? Wait for it. So either your run, if you haven't tested out your run yet, this is a good time to do it. You just go 25 seconds one way and then 25 seconds the other. Okay. Um, so either your run, your double unders, or your jumps for a minute. Test it out. Let's go.
All right. Good job, guys. Back in. So, yeah. Does anyone have any questions? I would put some music on if you want. Um, it is a 35 minute slog. Trying to get us back in, ready for those long wads, okay? Roz, is there, yes. a, is there a run at the end of at the end of the prisoner squats? Yeah, um, so Dan yeah. didn't write it on when I sent it to him, but after the prisoner squats, there is a run. Okay. Is that right? That's better. Oh, so guys, choose your poison. It's just as tough if you're doing those double unders or those jumps or the pendling jumps because 50 seconds is going to take it out of you. So I suggest you take your time on the exercises, yeah? Take your time on them, um, get that good quality in because I am expecting three rounds off you at least, team. So we're going to be with you. If we're not on camera, it's only because we're running, just give me a shout, team, okay? I'll see you on the other side. This one is a plod, yeah? We've done a couple of really hard sprints, but this one is a plod. I want you to push yourself. I want your heart rate to remain consistently high, but you can't go balls out at the beginning, Helen Styles, unless you're going to keep it up for 35 minutes. <laughs> not naming names. So if you're going off hard and fast at the beginning, you're staying hard and fast, team. All right, you're gonna enjoy this one, I promise. Mia's getting her 90s dance. She's ready to smash it in a flat, aren't you? Yes. It's, Ross, it's could you just move the clock across a little bit? Because I can't see the whole thing. Is that better? That's better. You don't need to see Trevor at them with those guys. That's better. <laughs> All right, team. So, what? Reverse lunges. Yeah. Goblet reverse lunges, yeah. Uh, goblet reverse lunges, yeah. Goblet reverse lunges. Okay, team, let's get ready with those 20 goblet squats. We've got 10 seconds. And I will see you on the other side. All right. Big slog from us all, but we're in it together, yeah? That's the key. Three, two, one. Let's go. Obviously. First couple of rounds of warming up, I tell you what, that warm all these jumps, run all the jumps, I'm gonna get deeper than I can get, guys. That's it. It's a bit misleading, this first round of the workout seems okay, and then it reminds you what it's like to work consistently for 35 minutes. <laughs> I was tired when I did it. Good. Nice. Yeah. Always love your massive dumbbell, Sarah. Good job, T. Oh yes, team. Awesome. So all the arm ones splitting up ten and ten. Whew. So nice to have the weather to actually be outside. Awesome. You're not overloading anything. Ten on each side. Use those legs to push. Awesome. It will soon go this time.
Awesome, guys. First round. Getting into these exercises. Simple exercises with the reverse lunges. Keep your core nice and tight. Good. Awesome. Stay upright. Nice team. Shouldn't be giving yourself too much time to recover. Just take your weighted exercise a little bit slower. Whew. Sorry, guys. Nice, guys. Good mirror that skipper. I'm sure your neighbours love that on a Sunday morning. <laughs> Good job. Awesome team, you just got to chip away. Five minutes in already. Guys, this one's going to catch you up. Yeah. We've done some real long burners recently. This is back to your Saturday morning, old school, long slog. Nothing too backy for those either today, yesterday. But when you've got that dumbbell in your hand, Time to focus. Awesome, Laura. Good, Laura. Nice. That's it, Nadine. Keep going. Smashing it, guys. Make sure you're pushing it on your jumps, or your skipping, or your run. Oh. Awesome work, guys. Coming to kind of the end of the first round. First round feels kind of simple. Nothing too complicated about these exercises. You want a constant state of being that little bit out of breath. That's what I'm looking for, yeah? Not too relaxed. But you can't sprint the whole time. Jumping or double under in. It's a long 50 seconds. Keep it going. Looking strong, guys. Kind of averaging. Getting around in at least 10 minutes. Wicked.
Nine minutes in. Go quickly, guys. Yeah. Slog it away. It's a long one. That's what we want today. Shouldn't be resting. You can take your time on the weighted exercises. Keep that quality in though. Awesome. Hopefully Andrew's doing all right, not getting his phone stolen. Good job. Nice team. Whew. You get into this second round, start to feel it a little bit more. You need to keep the pace up, but not be dying. You're 10 minutes into it. Yeah, already, that's wicked. Maybe further away. I should have called this one the creeper, that's what it does. Creeps up on you. Yeah. Trev smashing it already. Let's go. Just not enough time to get your breath back. You kind of want to be uncomfortable, but not dying. Yes, Helen. Good. Both Helen's. Nice. You're not even halfway through, yeah? So if you're feeling comfortable, Start to push it that little bit more. Nice and deep. Good. Awesome, Lauren. Nice. Everyone's kind of got their own bow in that 50 seconds. Doing great. Strain a little bit, team. Yeah, that's normal. Good. Awesome skipping a step. Me a nice jumping. Oh dear, that's it. So this is a good place to be at. Where I'm finding it quite hard to talk to you, <laughs> but you don't want to be absolutely dying because I need you to hold on for another 20 minutes. Yeah. Get used to this, team. We're going to be going back to some long wars on Wednesdays, long wars on Saturdays. Whew. And you want your endurance. Wicked work. That's it. Andrew, nice to have you back. Looking strong. Good job.
So actually guys, the burn here is on those runs, those jumps. If you're not doing too much on these dumbbells to overload yourself, yeah? The key is trying to keep your pace on your run, your pace on your juggling on this, and your pace on your jumps. Try not to let yourself get tired. These dumbbell exercises are moving through your upper and lower body shouldn't be too much of a challenge. You're 16 minutes in, that's nearly halfway. It's gonna go quickly, I promise, but it is gonna start to get tough. Coming up to halfway team, how does that feel? <laughs> this is one of these ones you're going to feel a bit tired and emotional. Kind of work out we have on a Saturday, I quite like the idea of having a shower and going back to bed. <laughs> Probably not that possible today. Good. The dumbbell is going to start to feel heavy when you get into those kind of third rounds. This is an original competition workout, and the whole thing is five rounds. So if some of you are pushing that, but awesome. I certainly couldn't get near it when I did it the other day. Nice. We're going for that 35 minute overall time cap. Nice job. Try not to rest too much, guys. The key is keep the consistent pace. Some of us are into those third rounds now, and you're coming up to 20 minutes. You're well over halfway. 
Doing great. I've got that class feeling here with Trev starting to lap me. But it's not often I bring my old hip out retirement for running. All for you guys. Keep going. Try and get deeper than I can on these squats. To start to really feel it right now. You're 20 minutes in. We've not been doing loads of workouts. Maybe kind of 20 minutes in the classes. Maybe a couple of mine, a couple of Laura's. But we all know when Saturdays and Wednesdays start again, we're going to have these long ones. So, getting in the swing of it. 20 minutes down. Oh, keep going. You need a little bit of mental strength now, guys, to carry yourself through. We're all here together. Keep pushing. Try not to slow the pace down on those bits in between the weights. We'll make sure we stretch out those calves after. But you're doing so well. Good. Keep going. Stick with it, team. You're gonna feel so good after. Maybe a little tired. I'm looking forward to my porridge. Keep going. That's it. Let's go, me. Let's get back in. Good job. Nice, Helen. You are smashing it, guys. Keep it going. Look at me, Carson. This was guys. Less than 12 minutes. If you're anything like me, legs are starting to get a little tired. Yeah, I told you this one was a creeper. You're doing awesome. Get at least three rounds in for me, T. Start to push into that fourth. Yeah, work yourselves. Is your legs going to start to feel it? That's it. Those of you on the double unders, you can have that good forearm pump too. Good. If you're running, get these arms involved. Nice, Sarah, good. Awesome. Guys, you are absolutely smashing it. Last 10 minutes coming up. Let's go. Stay motivated. Awesome, good Helen. Come on, guys. Ha! <sighs> 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 
Thank you guys, you gotta try and stick with that amount if you're on a time. Last nine minutes coming up. Everything starting to feel harder. Hopefully you're having some flashbacks to some long workouts. Back in the day before the assault bikes, <laughs> and we had to run. Not sure which one I prefer now. Good job, keep going. Wicked team. <sighs> This is the last kind of way you've got to dig in. We're all tired. You need to try and stay consistent with it. Come on, Helen. Wait for you. Just skip it. Here, Charlotte and Sarah. Dream team, come on. You got it, Steph. It's hit me a good job. Come on, team. You're so nearly there. Get these rounds in. So actually, guys, you're so nearly there. How about that? Should be getting at least three rounds in. Get ready to start that fourth if you haven't already. Nice. Doing so well. Some of you on your fourth, I can see. Not quite there yet. Good job. Seven minutes. This is your push. It's about enough time for a round. Let's go. Nice trip. Keep your quality on your exercises. Those weights, you can slow it down, but keep the quality. You're so nearly there. If by some miracle you're not feeling tired, pick the bloody pace up. Let's go. I'm nearly at that last five minutes I want everyone to put the pressure on you get through where they're at let's go 
Nice, Trev. Woo! Always at that constant pace of just trying to catch your breath. Doing awesome. Still trying to get as deep as you can on your squats and lunges. Not too top heavy today, but a lot of legs. Less than five minutes. You've got this, guys. You've got it. Smashing it. Let's go. Three and a half minutes should be time for a dumbbell and something. Come on. It's really hard to try and push through when you're tired. I need you to stay on it. Just three more minutes. What we say in team, get this done. Come on. Come on. You're so nearly there, I want you to pick up the pace if you've got it left in you. Finish on a high. Doing so well. Come on, two and a half minutes. Three, two, four. 
for quick rest and get some deep breaths in. Awesome, guys. How nice is that? Deep breaths in. You best get used to those guys because you know when we're back in the gym on Rod Wednesdays and Saturdays, you're going to have that feel, that long drag. So what I want you to do whilst you're getting your breath back is just lie down on the floor. I want everyone to stretch, guys. Just give me two minutes of your time. Done a lot of work then. Feet pointing forward, reach back. Deep, oh, oh, oh. Deep breath in through your nose. Out of your mouth. Yeah. Give me that left knee into your chest, yeah? A lot of hip work with the running and the jumping. Lots of squats. I told you it was a creeper. Good. Just give it a little bounce. Slowing that breathing down for me, change sides. <laughs> just realizing what we just did. 35 minutes of consistent work, guys. Good bit of endurance. We're just going to stretch that lower back out, especially those of you that did the workout yesterday. So palms to the floor, legs to the left side, look in the opposite direction. Good. Stretching out that lower back, especially if you did a lot of snatches and box jumps or burpees yesterday. This is my third week, change sides, where I haven't done burpees in a workout. Oh, I know. It's just like you do. I got one for yeah. Awesome, guys. So just standing up for me. Last couple of stretches. I want you to just come down, heel. And just push back on the opposite leg. Stretch out the back of the legs and the calves. Okay, push your bum back. So front leg straight, weight on your heels. Try and stretch out your calves. So... Keep holding. Two more weeks left on a Sunday. And the last Sunday, change sides, is Easter Sunday. Me and Trevor are going to start, uh, finish as we started, and we're going to set you a challenge on Easter Sunday, partner challenge, so you can eat all those Easter eggs. We've just got two more Sundays left. Good, push back. If you want to really stretch out those calves today, guys. Yeah, last one, left leg up, knees together. Push those hips out. Oh, let's say hi to everyone. <laughs> no. Oh, I've had a good workout today. Change side. She usually gets really fed up with just being in here, but she got to run. Didn't you? Awesome, guys. Yourselves a clap. So I'm expecting you to feel a little bit tired after that one. That's what we want, okay? I'd have a shot. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'd have a shower and a nap if you can. It's one of these nappy workouts, isn't it? Yeah. Have a nap. <laughs> have a nap. Maybe a little bit of breakfast. Maybe some of these Easter eggs you've already bought. So two more weeks. That's what I. All of you have got some kind of tired, pissed off faces. That's what I aim for as, as, when I when I do a workout. That's all I want. Tired. It's not personal. Off. <laughs> but it not work guys I know these slogs sometimes you've got to push through it but it's really <laughs> yeah Piper agrees it's nice to do it with you guys so two more weeks left I'm going to go hard and fast next week I haven't done burpees for three weeks so expect them back next week hard and fast next week Easter Sunday we're going to finish with a challenge awesome work guys have a good bye. Sunday stretch your calves off bye bye thanks Ross thanks Trev thank bye. you bye bye, bye. bye.